So Rebecca, introduce yourself to our audience. I'm Rebecca Brown Edelman, and I am playing Sarah Bernhardt in Bernhardt and Hamlet by Teresa Rebeck. What attracted you to the role of Sarah? Uh, there were several things that attracted me to the role of Sarah. One, that Sarah is a real historic human being uh, who had a just unbelievable life. And uh, as one gets older, there are fewer rich roles for women to play. And so when you find them, you want to inhabit them. And um, also, I feel really strongly that it's important to be a part of theater that addresses bigger issues and bigger topics. And this was a play that did just that. So what is this play about? So this play is about Sarah Bernhardt taking on Hamlet. That is one level. Some other levels that are in this play is a creative genius who behind the scenes is doubting whether or not she can ultimately pull it off. And then another level to this play is somebody who has to, who is questioning a dominant paradigm and has to constantly convince everyone else around her that what she is doing is okay for her to be doing. Why is the play important for audiences to see? I was thinking, the play is important for audiences to see, and I was thinking about this the other day. I knew of Cyrano de Bergerac before I knew who Sarah Bernhard was. And maybe that's a reflection on me, or maybe that's a reflection on how history is told. But I knew of a play written by a man before I knew of a woman who really paved the way for women in theater. And I think it's important for people to see this because I think it's important for people to hear her story. And I think it's important for people to explore gender and have a conversation on what it means for women in our society, uh, especially because that is a topic that continues to this day. I wonder if you have any reflections on the play in the context of Women's History Month. Are you rolling? Mm -hmm. Bernhard Hamlet is an important play for people to see during Women's History Month because it is a story of a woman and a historic figure and a woman who made more of an impact than I think we realize. And it's a story, her story is told through this play. So come see it so you can learn more about her. I didn't know about her until I started playing her. And she is a fascinating human being who never, against everything, she came into the world in a really hard way and she never stopped fighting. And that is incredibly inspiring for anybody who wants to make change. We need to hear stories about people who are trendsetters and are people who, who, who don't stop, they don't give up. And she really created a family around her of support to keep her going. And that's why you should come see this play. Maggie, who do you play in this piece? I play Lisette, who is the actor who's playing Ophelia in Sarah's production of Hamlet. She's a fan of Sarah's, but she's also a supporter and a friend. Um, but mostly she's taking notes because she wants to be at Sarah's level one day or maybe even better. What attracted you to audition for the play? I think she's funny and kind and smart, and it's really nice to see her cheer on Sarah, but also carry her through some of her moments of self-doubt. Um, it makes her a really interesting character to play because she doesn't just yes her to death, she has very hard conversations with her. Why is the play important for audiences to see? I think that the show makes Shakespeare a lot more accessible to audiences who maybe have not had experience with Shakespeare before or aren't a fan. Um, because I love Shakespeare myself, but I love to question him and analyze the characters. It, it's a lot of fun. 
I wonder if you have any reflections on the play in the context of Women's History Month. Well, Sarah Bernhardt was a real person. Um, so she really faced all of this criticism and doubt and um, uncertainty over playing Hamlet and she really did it, um, which is really important to us to look back on and see and I think more people should know her story. <laughs> so Janie, who are you in this piece? I play Raoul. Raoul is a member of Sarah's company who is presenting Hamlet. He's a, a bit of a space cadet, perhaps not as experienced and into it as his fellow actors, but also I'd say he, he wouldn't mind this moment in the spotlight. What attracted you to audition for the play? I love doing straight plays, and as an adolescent female, there aren't necessarily as many opportunities to do them. So I'm just like, Joe, please give me a part. And he did, so I'm very grateful. <laughs> Why is the play important for audiences to see? So one thing that I think is really interesting about this play is what a big thing that's talked about is why Sarah is playing Hamlet and what is her motivation? Is it an act of ego? Is it for women? Is it for her audience? Is it for herself? And I feel like as actors and even as people, when we think about taking on a role, it's so important to think, who am I doing this for? What am I trying to prove? why do I want to play this role? And I think that that's a really important thing for us all to consider when taking on something ambitious. I wonder if you have any reflections on the play in the context of Women's History Month. Hamlet is kind of Shakespeare's gift to all actors and actors and actresses. And I feel like what this play shows is that uh, Sarah Bernhard took that gift of Hamlet and gave it to women and said this is something a microcosm of kind of all humanity that we can all share. And so I think that's kind of how Sarah Bernhard made history, women's history. It all comes together. <laughs> you 